Now, just in case you guys forgot, I live in a bus. Now, as a reflector, living in a bus for me is one of the ways that I've kind of like hacked reality because a lot of living situations for my, in my life have been with family, with partners, with roommates, and I have never really had my own space. And so back before I moved to Maui, I was living in a van. Now here I have a bus. This is pretty new, guys. This is something that happened in February for me. TikTok made me go viral in January, and that's why we were able to afford this. And so let's do the tour. Forgive, it's kind of messy. Let's start with the messy stuff, actually. So this is all of my um, music equipment, um, computer equipment. That's my guitar, gym bag, my big towel, my basket, all of my things kind of like are back in there. Some of my bigger clothes are back here. Got my drums, laundry, super important. This area is really cool because all of the fuses, there it goes, are like right back there. That's where a lot of my power kind of comes from. And I got little cords coming out the side here. Let's put that back. Then we have the beginning of my like mixer and music station. So mixer, this is the L12. It's an interface and a mixer. For anyone that's into music, that's a nuanced thing and it's very cool. These are my Neumanns. These are like $1,500 microphones to capture music from the hand pan, which I have not been making much hand pan music the past couple years, but I'm now that I have my own space, give me enough lunar cycles and it's gonna happen. Um, tripod stand. Desk area, it's a sit stand desk, super important for me. This is called the neutral chair, which is epic. It's one of the coolest chairs I've ever found. It's got one of those. Saga! My bed over here, DJ equipment, whiteboard, snake plant for good vibes. That's Emmy, prioritize. I almost lost my fucking mind putting that up. But this is the bed where I sleep. And for reference, that-ish direction is north. So I sleep with my head over here in the west. This is my little tea area and my little tiny whiteboard. There's Grogu. Oh, sorry, buddy. All smacked up in there. Then I've got this side of the bus, which has got my microphone, my guitar, my guitar pedal, which conveniently hides under here. What is that? Oh, it's a moth. Okay, anyway, all my clothes are in here, along with some other various items. Nice area here. This is like my altar for all intensive purposes. So I got my oils, my supplements, my diffuser for burning frankincense and stuff. This is for if I want to get a little Wingardium Leviosa on them. Got those lights. All right, come on lights, turn off. Where's the button? By the way, I've yet to find like an actual quality version of these, not that they really need to be quality, but they're always so cheap. Like they do the job, but they're, they're so cheap. And I'm wondering if there's like a quality version. So if you have one, let me know in the comments. Anyway, that's pretty much it. There's the bus and eventually I am gonna paint the outside, which is gonna be cool. But for now, thanks for joining for the tour. Peace. By the way, if you're not following me, um, I don't normally do uh, bus conversion content. I do mostly like human design and spiritual stuff and Reiki stuff and music things, but this is such a huge part of my life. And so if you guys have questions or you wanna know more about living in a bus, or maybe I can even tell my story of how I got the bus is interesting. And also how I got my van is also interesting. Pure manifestation, I used magic baby. So anyway, thanks for watching this video. Make sure to follow if you're not already following. Peace.